Welcome back NYC fragrance family. Joe's here with a video. Look at that. So today I have a fragrance for you that is from a new brand. It's on the niche side of things, a little pricey here, but for those of you that want those type of fragrances or looking for niche fragrances, I feel this is one I had to talk about. The one that I have to show you today is called The Must. This is the box. It's got like a little canvas feel to it. Kind of luxurious. Nice metal plate on the front. Opens up nice and easy. You got a bottle. And the nice cool thing that they do, they give you a travel atomizer that you could fill up from the bottom, which is actually really cool to have. Something I've never seen that a brand has done, which is a nice little touch. For those of you that don't want to bring a bottle with you when you travel and you want to bring the fragrance, you got the little travel atomizer right there. This is the bottle itself. The cap is not magnetic. It's kind of like slightly pressured. I wouldn't pick it up from the cap. It is not very tight. So it doesn't snap into place, but got some weight to it. It's a very nice cap if you ask me. Let's get into the fragrance itself, right? That's what you're all here for. So this fragrance opens up very fruity. The bergamot melon pineapple mix is prevalent right up front. This thing has bergamot, it has green notes, there's some melon, there's some pineapple as I just mentioned. There's an ambery quality in the dry down. It's got vanilla, which is definitely prominent. You will pick up the vanilla. It also dries down nice and musky with a woody touch. There are woody notes in the dry down in the base of this fragrance that you do pick up. So, what do I get as far as when and where to wear this? This is definitely for me spring, summer, fall, maybe winter, depending on how you're feeling. It could be all seasons. As far as spring and summer, I would go with nighttime rather than daytime because it does have some density in the dry down for sure. It is a strong fragrance because that couple of sprays in the air has filled the entire room. It is definitely blended well, very strong, very sweet up front. For those of you that like sweet fragrances, this is definitely something you'll enjoy. So, a lot of brands come out, people think right away, are they a clone brand, you know, what are they doing? I don't feel that this is a clone. If I had to give you an idea of what it's similar to as far as something it might smell like, maybe close to Herba Pura, which I wouldn't say it's spot on the same, there are some nuances that remind you of that. I almost think when I smell it, I, I always think of it almost like a blend of two fragrances that I'm familiar with. It kind of almost like reminds me of combining Jean-Paul Gaultier's Ultramal with Paco Rabanne 1 million and putting them together. Because you get that like, you know, the freshness and that apple -y thing going on like with the pineapple and the amber and the melon that you would get like Ultramal sweetness up front. And then with that vanilla and the amber and that quality combining gives me the thought of the way Paco Rabanne 1 million would smell. And you put them together and you have the must. This is a parfum concentration, 100 ml bottle. On the website, it's going for 210 US dollars. Do I think that that's a good value? I think for the quality of the fragrance you're getting, compared to some of the fragrances out there at retail today, even some designers that are charging close to this price, you're getting something that's really good and really good quality. It's nice to be back. It's nice to know that I'm gonna be putting out some more videos for those of you that have been waiting on them. I am gonna record quite a few in a, you know, going forward. I've been you know tied up, busy, kind of a long hiatus, but I'm back. See how long I'm back, but for now I'm back. Anyway, new subscribers, I know it's been a long wait for a new video. Thank you for joining the NYC Fragrance family. New viewers, thank you for stopping by. And my NYC Fragrance family, thank you for staying loyal while I've been away and staying with me. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And until the next time, remember, if you smell good, you feel good. Have a nice day.